Everybody Hates Chris came from being on the set of The Longest Shot. Chris took notice of me. He said he noticed that I was a father. He noticed, you know, because I had my kids on set, I was bringing them and the whole thing. He also, and this is the thing, when I tell you people are watching you, he also noticed how I was around other women or around other people. And he saw that, he was like, this dude is about his family. He said, I got something for you. Now, I was at home probably about three weeks later. I get a script. No heads up, no warning, no nothing. Open it up. And it says, everybody hates Chris. Now, I'm laughing already because the show Everybody Loves Raymond was already on the air. And I was like, everybody hates Chris. That's hilarious. Just, just that joke. And I opened it up. It was one of the funniest things I have ever read in my life. 30 pages of pure gold. And I was like, oh, my God. Now I wanted it. I was the first guy hired on that show. Everybody Hates Chris took over that year. The buzz was good, everything was great, and it was four wonderful seasons of being this wonderful African-American dad. I, Julius, am the only character named after a real family member because that's how much Chris's dad meant to his comedy. And I mean, to play such an iconic character in his life and for him to trust me with that. Chris has other brothers and sisters that are like, man, thank you. Thank you for representing our dad the way you did. I mean, I get a little choked up. These are real people we're talking about. You know, his father died before he could see all of his success. And when I look at everybody hates Chris now, I'm beyond proud. Mm -hmm.